Good morning children. In the previous video, we have learned about how to identify numbers on the APCUS scale. Now, in this video, we will learn about how to draw the beads while the answer is given. Okay children, till now, what was given? Beads. The beads were already drawn on the page and you have to write the answer. Now, it is a different case where the beads are not drawn and the answers are given below and you have to draw the beads so that the answers will be shown to you as per the answer given below in the block. Supposedly, if the answer is 1, how you will do? Suppose if the answer is 1, you have to draw one bead like this. Now, for 2, what you have to do? You have to draw two lower beads like this one bead and two beads. Okay? For 3, you have to draw three lower beads. One, two and this three. For four, draw four beads. The lower side of the apcus. One, two, this is three and this is four. Okay? Now for five, what we have to do? You have to draw one upper bead. As children, we all know that the upper bead has a value of 5. So, we don't have to draw these lower beads. We will draw one upper bead which has a value of 5. Now, for 6, what we have to do? We will draw one upper bead which has a value of 5 and one lower bead. Now, it is 5 plus 1 that is 6. For 7, draw one upper bead, value of 5. And for 7, we have to draw two lower beads. 1, 2. This is 5 plus 2. That is 7. Now for 8, this is 5. And now we have to draw three lower beads. 1, Two, this is three. Five plus three, that is eight. Now for nine. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now children, like this, all, the, all these one-digit numbers have to be drawn. And the answers will be given in the block and you have to draw like this on the unit rod. Now class, I am ending today's topic over here. I hope you all like the video. Thank you.